Aislinn and if you follow me on Instagram you know that I just moved. My husband and I just purchased our first house together so I'm still trying to figure out like a filming setup. If you guys have any suggestions on what you would like to see in the background of my videos if you like the backdrop better or if you like to see like a vanity and stuff like this then I can do this but maybe tweak it a little bit um, so just let me know what you guys like if you like the backdrop comment down below and say you like the all one color backdrop if you prefer to see stuff behind me like this Leave a comment down below letting me know that you like to see things in the background and you like to see my vanity. Moving on to today's video. Today I have a Bath & Body Works haul for you guys. Basically Bath & Body Works has a semi-annual sale. I think they do it twice a year and I go every single time they have it because lotions that are normally like $12.50 are reduced to $4. So I always go during the semi-annual sale and stock up on everything that I need. And one of my favorite things to buy is hand soaps because I run through them like crazy and I love Bath & Body Works hand soaps. So I'm just going to get into everything that I purchased at Bath & Body Works and I'm going to start with my favorite things I got which are hand soaps. So the first hand soap I got is called Island Papaya and this is just described as tropical coconut, fresh papaya, and sugar cane. This smells amazing. I have been so into like tropical coconut scents this summer. It just brings me back to like summertime and vacation and everything like that. So this smells amazing. It just smells like a tropical vacation and I definitely smell a lot of the papaya versus the other two ingredients. Moving on to my second hand soap I purchased. This one is Watermelon Lemonade and this is just described as Juicy Watermelon and Sweet Meyer Lemon. Two of my absolute favorite scents. It just smells like summertime goodness and every time I wash my hands I'm just like it's like fresh and clean and that's like my favorite scents. I also got this scent in the deep cleansing hand soap. So this one is just the taller one and it's more like a gel whereas this one is the foaming one. I really tried to get a lot of the foaming ones because they actually have more in them. They have 8.75 fluid ounces and this one only has 8 fluid ounces. So I tried to find as many of the foaming ones as I could but they didn't have some of the scents in the foaming one. Um, and I didn't realize I got two of these, but I'm glad I did because this is one of my favorite scents. I'm going to smell it real quick. <laughs> oh my god! I love it so good. This next foaming hand soap is my husband's absolute favorite scent, and that is why I got it. I got this lotion a while ago because it reminds me of like my childhood. And so I picked it up and it was his favorite lotion smell I think that I've ever gotten. He uses it all the time as lotion and it is in the scent Cucumber Melon. So when I saw this, I picked it up and had to grab it because I knew that he would love it. So this scent is described as crisp cucumber, watery honeydew, and juicy cantaloupe. I always lean more toward like citrusy scents. So this is another one that's just like very light and fresh. Okay, so I have two soaps left and both of them are the deep cleansing hand soaps. This next one is fresh lemonade. Like I told you guys earlier, I love lemon scented and lemon flavored everything. So this fresh lemonade is described as lemon juice, lime twist, and sugar crystals. The last hand soap I have is also one of my all time favorite scents ever. I think I have every lotion in this scent. And this is Georgia Peach. If you guys do not know, my mom lives in Savannah, Georgia. So every time I see anything that's like Georgia Peach, I always pick it up because it just reminds me of her and I also love the smell of peach. Like peach lotion is one of my favorite things. Again, with like the very crisp and clean and citrusy smells, those are my favorite. Especially with hand soaps, I want my hands to smell like clean after I wash them and not like sweet and like really sugary. I would prefer it to be like a clean crisp smell. So this is the Georgia Peach and this is described as sweet peach, orange blossom, and honeysuckle nectar. Okay, so the main portion of this haul is lotions. One of my absolute favorite scents of all time is Dark Kiss. This is like my tried and true, I always go back to this. It is such like a deep, 
sultry smell and I love it so much. So when I saw that they had the Ultra Shea body cream, I definitely picked one of these up. I also picked up just the regular lotion. So the smell for this is black raspberry, burgundy rose, bergamot incense, dark vanilla bean, and plum musk. I love earthy smells and like dark sultry smells and this encapsules all of those things. Okay, so the second lotion I picked up is Grapefruit Breeze. When I saw this, I about had a mini heart attack because when I was in middle school, they had a lotion called Pink Grapefruit. That was my jam back in middle school. I loved it so much. It was my favorite scent. All of the girls were wearing it. It was like the popular scent and it smelled amazing. So when I saw they had a grapefruit one, I was like, ooh, beach. Let me pick that up real quick. And I was so excited to see grapefruit that I picked up two. <laughs> I actually used this all over my body when I got out of the shower yesterday and I loved the way it smelled. It is absolutely amazing. The description for Grapefruit Breeze is a spritz of pink grapefruit, a bunch of iced raspberries, and a squeeze of lime. I mean, does that not sound absolutely amazing? Again, with the raspberry, I am obsessed with the smell of raspberries. Pink grapefruit, raspberries, and lime. I mean, what more could you ask for? This next scent kind of goes along with the other one and it is Mango Mandarin. This is described as Juicy Mango, Sparkling Mandarin Orange, and Nectarine Blossom. This is so great, I've never tried this before, but when I smelled it and saw it, I knew I was gonna like it because again, it's one of those citrus smells. I saw this next lotion and normally, this is not a fragrance that I would wear, but because I've been so into it this summer, I decided I was gonna pick it up. It is Fresh Coconut Colada. I don't know what it is. I've been going to the pool like every single day this summer. I've been using like suntan lotion and it smells like a tropical vacation. So when I saw this in Bath and Body Works, I picked it up immediately because the smell just reminds me of a tropical vacation and it just reminds me of that coconutty summer vibe. So I'm gonna use this during the summer for sure, especially on like pool days. It just makes you think you're on a tropical vacation even though you're in the middle of Indiana. Me. <laughs> Fresh Coconut Colada is described as a splash of coconut milk, a dash of vanilla rum, topped with pink hibiscus. That's pretty freaking accurate. It is so delicious. And the dash of vanilla rum, now that they say that, I totally smell it in there. It's so good and just tropical. Mmm. I love this so much. So the next body lotion I got, I had in a travel size and I carried it around in my purse for a long time and I used it all up and I decided to go ahead and purchase the full size version when I saw it. It is Pink Cashmere. And this is a scent that I don't normally lean to, but because I liked it so much in my travel size, I decided to pick it up and I'm going to use this to refill my little travel guy. Pink Cashmere is described as pink jasmine petals, creamy sandalwood, white amber, and cashmere musk. Okay, so we are down to the last body lotion. This one, Dark Kiss, and the grapefruit one are my favorite, and this one, I don't know. I'm really into this one this summer. This is Sun Ripened Raspberry. I just wanna eat this. It smells so good. It smells like clean laundry and raspberries. It's just so good smelling and clean. I know I've said this like a million times. Crisp and clean, crisp and clean. This is crisp and clean. And it's so crisp and clean, I got it in the body wash too because I want to smell crisp and clean, you know what I'm saying? So I got the lotion and the body wash. Again, these retail for $12.50 and they were like $3.98. So I definitely stocked my little ass up. Little, yeah right, who am I kidding? I definitely stocked my big ass up. <laughs> Oh, I'm putting this on right now. I, I can't. This is just so good. It just has like, it just has like a clean laundry smell to it. Yeah, like clean, fresh laundry with a little bit of that like citrus smell in it. Oh, I love this one. It's so good and fresh. Mmm. Puts me in a better mood. You know what I'm saying? Those scents that just make you happy. This is that one. So sun ripened raspberry is described as sun ripened raspberries, strawberry leaves, 
and sugar crystals. I did purchase one more thing and it is hand sanitizer. I am a hand sanitizer freak. I literally carry like five in my car, five in my purse. I love hand sanitizer. I love having them on me at all times because I'm like a tiny bit of a germaphobe, you know what I mean? Like I really like to have clean hands, especially like if I'm in public and I'm constantly touching like carts and doorknobs and stuff that a million people touch during the day. I need hand sanitizer to make myself feel a little bit better. So the hand sanitizer that I decided to pick up this time is called Future Misses. The scent for this is Pretty as a Peach, you guys know. As I said before, I am so into peach scents. So I just picked up three of these. This is how long my receipt is. I almost can't even fit it in the camera frame. It's so long. Purchased 18 items and my total was $52.60 right there. So I paid roughly $2.92 an item. Last time I did a Bath and Body Works haul, I got so many comments saying, why didn't you use your $10 off coupon? There's a coupon that apparently everybody in the world knew about except for me, and it is $10 off when you spend $40 or more. So I went back to that video before I went and I looked at the comments and I followed you guys' instructions. You guys told me exactly how to get the coupon and where I could find it at. So I did that this time and I got my $10 off. So thank you guys so much for that. I will definitely always use that in the future. That is all I have for today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really like doing hauls, especially with Bath & Body Works. This purchase was like a blackout purchase, meaning I went in and I was about to grab like a little bit of stuff, but I actually grabbed a lot of bit of stuff, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I love you guys so much. And until next time, guys, stay weird. Bye. Let me know if you want a new house tour.